Ladies and gentlemen, in this video, we will be opening the scariest zoo Minecraft has ever seen. Our zoo will include scary Minecraft myths, ranging from blood golems all the way to this. What is that? As I added more scary Minecraft mobs to my zoo, something didn't feel right. It felt like I was being watched. Ah, it's probably nothing. Ah, uh, yes. The smell of fear. This is where I will break ground for the world's scariest zoo. Our good friend Betty the zookeeper gave me 10 coins to start out, which we could use to buy zoo pass for 5 coins. Oh yeah, boys, check this out! We're gonna be able to make so many scary exhibits. What else can we buy? We can buy a scary sheep exhibit for 5 coins, and it's interactive. Well, that can't be good. Betty said, nice work. Your first customers will be arriving shortly on the bus. All right, guys, look at this. We got scary sheep. They look kind of normal to me. What's so scary about these guys? Do something scary. You guys are just normal sheep. My customers are going to hate this. Um, what if I... Whoa, what the heck? Oh my God, dude, its mouth is so big. You do it too? What? That is so cursed. I'm going to leave this one alone. The more scary myths that we add to the Beck Bro Zoo means more customers. And more customers means more money. We could use that money to buy scarier myths later in today's video. The people are loving it. Come on in, ladies and gentlemen. I don't even want to know what happened to this guy. Let's go see what we can buy next. A Chucky exhibit for 20 20 coins. Boom! Let's go check it out. And it is front and center. Oh my gosh, dude. Is this even legal? I have a bunch of killer babies in my zoo. Whatever you guys do, don't tell the police. I mean, they don't look that scary, right? That has to be the biggest baby on planet Earth. Hey there, little guy. How's it going? That's a big knife you got there. I'm just gonna back away slowly, all right? I'm gonna leave you alone and you leave me alone. Nobody has to get stabbed today. I really gotta get security at this zoo. The People are loving it, which means that I'm getting fat stacks of cash. Next up, we can afford to get the blood golem for 50 coins. I think I found them. Ew, oh my gosh. I thought it was kidding when it mentioned blood golems. These guys are grotesque. What the? Whoa, whoa, what happened to my arms? Give them back, give them back. No, 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 give them back. I didn't mean it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. What the flip is happening to me? I'm already part human, part zombie. I did not want to be part blood golem. Actually, I'm, I kind of like it. What's up there, big guy? You're not so scary after all. <laughs> this is awesome. I can pick them up and then I can throw them up in the sky. Come on over here, guys. Oh, look, guys, we got a visitor. Hey, what's up, dude? Look at me. Look up. Oh, oh he, he left as soon as he saw my face. Am I really that ugly? Uh, no, 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 no. You stay in there. I'm picking you up. I can't have one of my scary myths escape this early on. So far, so good, guys. This place isn't that spooky after all. Next up, for 75 coins, we can get the Teletubbies exhibit. I don't know about you guys, but when I was younger, the Teletubbies were the scariest thing in my life. Even though they were supposed to be these, like, big Elmo characters, they did not do good things for my mental health. And it looks like we have to face those fears. Okay, I mean, they look pretty cool in there. All right, so there's the guy with the hat on. I, I see one of the Teletubbies in there. Can I get inside? Oh, there's an iron door. I guess that's for security purposes. Hey, uh, your name's Tinky Winky, right? Okay, guys, all right. Oh, why do you look so angry? Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and just, I'm just gonna give you a little tap on the belly. Just a little tickle. Oh, 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 God, what? That wasn't so bad. Oh, okay, all right, no, that was fine. I think I'm just more scared because I thought that the Teletubbies were the scariest thing when I was younger. They're not that bad after all, right? Uh, okay, maybe they are. What the flip is this? Okay, what, what happens if I... Okay, all right, I'm out of here. Nope, nope, nope. You guys are creepy. I... No, nope, nope, nope. That's fine. I don't need to look at you any longer than I already did. I'm just gonna eat my cookies just like I did when I was younger. Cookie make pain go away. Luckily, we have a bunch of freaks coming into my zoo that absolutely love this type of stuff. And I will give them more. Next up, we can get a creepy clown exhibit. This one's gonna be weird. Okay, it looks like creepy clown straight ahead. Come on in, ladies and gentlemen. We just got our brand new exhibit. Creepy clowns. Oh, they don't look too bad. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to the Beck Bro Zoo. It's really nice having you guys here. My name's Jack. What's your name? Oh, God. Okay, all right. What the flip are you guys made of? I'm just gonna leave this in here with you guys. And uh, yeah, you guys just... um. Okay, bye. Don't go in there. Their bodies are so frail that they fall apart when you touch them. Welcome, welcome. Nice to see you guys. So far, our zoo is actually pretty successful. Even though I probably have mental trauma, it's fine. It's all worth it. Next up, we can get our hands on a giant Alex exhibit. 
I don't think I've actually seen Giant Alex before, but I've seen so many videos about Giant Alex. So I'm looking forward to meeting her. Oh my gosh. I was gonna ask myself, where is Giant Alex? But uh, I, I think I answered that question. This has to be our best exhibit yet. Hey, what's going on? Okay, so it looks like there's only one Giant Alex, which is cool. That's manageable. Am I able to get inside? Ah! What the flip was that? Giant Alex said something. Beware of Herobrine. He cannot be contained. He will be your zoo's demise. Uh, Betty the zookeeper didn't tell me anything about Herobrine. Well, why do I feel like I'm being watched now? Well, I mean, thanks for the message, Giant Alex. I feel like there was a better way to maybe go about doing that rather than screaming in my flipping ear. But that's okay. All right, cool. Message received. Why would I listen to Giant Alex? She's probably just trying to scare me. Let's go ahead and move on to the next exhibit with me many voices. Oh, our first SCP. Whoa. Okay. I think I found the exhibit. Oh, what's up there, little guys? Oh my gosh. They have such giant teeth. Are you guys friendly? All right, guys. I am your owner. You now belong to me. I am Beck Bro Jack, owner of the world's scariest Minecraft zoo. I mean, yeah, they, they seem pretty friendly towards me. Thank you for your healthy contribution to the Beck Bro Scary Zoo. We're going to go ahead and use that in order to buy Thomas.exe for 200 coins. Let's go check it out. Hey there, Thomas. Why is it that half of the scary creatures today are from my childhood? I feel like I'm gonna need therapy. Just eat the cookies, Jack. Just eat the cookies like your mom told you to. All right, yeah, it should be fine. Hey, what's up, Thomas the Trade? Um, all right, I, I just wanna get nice and close. It's gonna be fine. Um, What happens if I just stop you? Oh, no, he seems chill with that. Hey, what's up there, Thomas? Oh, oh okay, cool. He seems fine. Whoa, 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 I can ride on him. Holy smokes, dude. Okay, all right, all right. I don't think he likes this. Okay, all right, all right, I'll get off. I'll, where do I go? Okay, okay, okay. I'm gone. You didn't have to be so rude about it. What the heck was that, guys? I'm just gonna head back over here. The blood golems don't seem so bad anymore. We still have a lot more scary exhibits to add if I want to live up to my name of the world's scariest zoo. Next up, we need to add in the blood warden. This has to be like the blood golems, but upgraded. Do you guys hear that? What the? Is that the blood golem? Oh my god, this guy is terrifying. Do you guys see this? I mean, Jeff here is loving it. Uh, yo, 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 Jeff, do not go inside. I think Jeff is dead. Okay, if I was a smart man, I would probably leave here. But as the zookeeper owner, I got to give them a warm welcome. Hey, ah, I just wanted to welcome you to my zoo. What are you doing? Stop, stop it. Ah, oh god, okay, okay, fine. Oh god, my ears. Holy smokes. What the heck? Heck. I'm gonna go ahead and never go into this exhibit ever again in my entire life. I don't think my eardrums will ever be the same. Hey guys, go ahead. Yeah, go check out the warden over there. The, the blood warden. Super cool guys. Okay, we have tons of coins that I need to start spending. Let's get a possessed farm and let's also get Entity 303. That's gonna be my new favorite. Oh my gosh, this place is starting to come together. This looks like one of the new exhibits. Hey, what's up there, little guys? Oh my goodness. Um, are you guys possessed by Hero Brian? Possessed pig. Okay, all right. They are definitely possessed. I'm gonna do my best to just not look them dead in the eyes. I heard a rumor that if you look at Herobrine for too long, that's how he possesses you. So far, I mean, it seems like, yeah, they are all possessed. There is not one single mob in this exhibit that is not possessed. Well, welcome to the Beckbro Zoo. Have a cookie. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. See ya. And it looks like right next door is Entity 303. Wait, that actually kind of looks like Entity 303. We have a breach. No escaping. Whatever you guys do, don't tell anyone that you saw that. I gotta make sure to secure these guys. I'm basically the SC. I need to secure, contain, protect. Why is this door open? That's how they got out. Hey, what's up, fellas? Um, so I just wanted to let you know about some of our rules and regulations. Uh, you guys are totally welcome at the Beck Bro Zoo, but you just gotta make sure that you don't leave. All right, you guys gotta stay inside of your exhibit. Is that is that cool? Oh God, what the flip? Oh, 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 wait a second, wait a second. No, 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 no. I don't want to be Entity 303. I don't like this. I don't like this. Everything is glowing. Turn me back. Oh my gosh. Whoa, whoa. Hold up. Wait a second. This is actually kind of cool. I could jump super. Hi. Okay, I guess this is okay for now. I can't tell if I'm possessed by Entity 303 and he's inside of my body or... Oh, never mind. I guess he's gone. They did it again. They did it again. What the heck, dude? What is that sound? Okay, I don't know if it was just because I was Entity 303, but I don't know. Something sounded weird. I can hear the blood golem, but it sounded a little bit different. Uh, 
I'm starting to get a little bit creeped out. But that's not going to stop me. I have a mission. Let's go ahead and spawn in the next exhibit, Siren Head. We might as well also spawn in Shy Guy next, too. And let's see. Let's get also a Huggy Wuggy. I think we just spawned in three of the most popular horror characters to ever exist. Let's go track them down, boys. Ooh. Oh, cool. It's Shy Guy. Okay, whatever you do, do not look Shy Guy in the face. Bad things will happen if you do. Hey, what's up, dude? Gonna be okay, all right? Everything's gonna be fine. Just don't look at me. Might need to change my pants. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is is why you don't look at Shy Guy. Don't look at Shy Guy. Okay, let's just go say hi to Huggy Wuggy. Huggy Wuggy loves giving out hugs. Huggy Wuggy, I could really use a hug right about now. Just be nice, okay? Okay, this Huggy Wuggy looks really, really creepy. I remember when it first came out, I thought it looked a lot like Big Bird, who also used to creep me out when I was younger. I thought to myself, well, how could a bird be so big and so fluffy? And then I was even more confused when I went to a zoo and I saw an ostrich. How does that thing even even exist. So with that being said, uh, welcome to the zoo. Hope you guys have a great stay. Uh, have, have yourself a cookie and I'm gonna be on my way. This zoo is getting creepier by the minute. But the best part is we are making more money by the minute too. Everybody is absolutely loving it. Okay, let's go check this out. What the? Um, excuse me, sir. Do, what, do not walk up there. Do you not understand? This is Siren Head. He's like a class four threat. These actually kind of look like baby Siren Heads. Look at these weird little dudes. All right. Oh, yo, what are you doing in there? Okay. All right. This is exactly what you're not supposed to do. Um, oh, okay. All right. We gotta, we gotta just take care of this. Get, no, you, no, 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 no. I had to do it. We really need to start hiring security, especially with siren heads. What are you doing? Stop. Hey, Betty, when you get a chance, I need you to hire security. We definitely have enough money. Check it out, guys. We have 6,500 coins, which means we could definitely afford the blood villager. And we can also get SCP-001. I think this might be the first ever SCP. And we have a little bit of leftover money in order to get assimilated mobs. I have no idea what that means, and I'm not sure I want to find out. Ooh. Okay, so this is SCP-001. Oh my gosh. It looks disgusting. Look at these chunky guys. Okay, I just gotta make sure not to get too close. I'm pretty sure they don't have eyeballs. So as long as I'm pretty quiet, I don't think they can hear me. <laughs> look, look, they have no idea where I am. <laughs> if I had to guess, these guys probably smell like skunks mixed with trash can mixed with a turd, but that's just a guess. And right next door, we have the assimilated Minecraft mobs, which are basically just parasites. Now, they look friendly enough. Ew, dude, I don't like this one bit. Oh my god, what is that? It kind of looks like a Wendigo. And then we have Steve. If Steve was possessed by the demons. I don't even know which demons, just all the demons. Well, it seems like you guys are nice and comfy here. Um, even the sheep. Oh, I thought the sheep was normal. Nope, it is not. It's British. And I'm pretty sure there was one other exhibit around here that we bought. Oh, here it is. The Blood Villagers. Hey, what's up, fellas? So, uh, yeah, I heard you guys worship the devil and you guys love blood. Is this true? Oh, yep. He, he just confirmed it, I'm pretty sure. You guys have any, like, cool trades or anything? What about in here? I just wanted to see if they had trades. Betty, I'm not gonna lie. You did an, an absolutely fantastic job getting the scariest Minecraft myths. Almost too good of a job. All right, let's go check out the next one. SCP-999. I actually think this one's friendly. If I remember correctly, SCP-999 is a giant slime that flops around. Oh, look at this. They're not scary at all. They're big and slimy and adorable. Look at that. They have like a giant smile on their face. I'm also 95% certain that this SCP makes everything around it happy, which is a nice change because everything else in this zoo has made me extremely terrified. I gotta start hanging around this SCP a lot more. Okay, just, just let me out. All right, guys, we have a ton of money to spend. We can get SCP-106. I'm pretty sure that's the old guy SCP who can make his own pocket dimension to trap me in for all of eternity. Sounds like a lovely guy. We can also get Slender Man. That's gonna be creepy. And let's also get In Silence. I wonder if this is another SCP. This place is awesome. Awesome. There's so many people everywhere. Well, I guess not people, ghosts, but their money's real. Ooh, check it out. It's the old man SCP. Let's go inside and, uh, all right. Yeah, he, you know, he seems cool. Hey, what's up, man? Uh, looks like you could probably use a little bit of moisturizer. <laughs> Let me go! What are you doing? Dude, let me go! What the flip? Put me down. I'll give you cookies. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Okay, okay, okay. Let me out of here. Get me the flip out of here. What the heck was that? All right, well, you are definitely worthy of being in the zoo. That is for sure. I didn't need you to prove that, but you did anyway. And it looks like a few of our new exhibits are over here. Yep, I see the big old Slender Man. Oh, what the? What even is that? I kind of want to touch it. Dude, what does that do? Doesn't really seem like much. Okay, overall, even though these guys look spooky, they haven't done anything to jump scare me, so I think they're my new favorite. You guys have yourself a slenderful day. I'm just gonna go this way. And the other one that we bought, <laughs> I honestly forget the name. What are these things? I think they were called In Silence. Okay, let's just head inside. Oh, wow, they walk on soul sand. Interesting. And they kind of look like a werewolf that lost its lower jaw. Uh, hey, okay, are, are you friendly? Can, can we just be, be cool? We're just gonna be chill with one another? All right, yeah, it seems like they like me. Even though they are probably the creepiest creatures in our entire zoo, they're actually quite friendly. I'll take it, dudes. Have yourselves a cookie full day. Ladies and gentlemen, all things considered, I think that this is actually coming together as one of my best zoos of all time. I mean, at this point, what could go wrong? Coming up next, we can buy a baby wither storm. Okay, that is flipping awesome. And we can also get a mutant zombie exhibit. And we have so much leftover cash. Let's get Freddy Fazbear. Comment down below what you guys thought of the FNAF movie. I thought it was pretty good. Okay, since we're pretty much running out of room, I'm guessing all of these exhibits are gonna spawn way in the back. Ladies and gentlemen, follow me to our brand new three exhibits. Stay away from the old man though. He's creepy. Oh, dude, check this out. This looks sweet. It's actually Freddy Fazbear. Let's go, dude. Woo! -hoo -hoo. What the, ah, what the shit? Why? Why? Okay, okay, I'm gone. Why did he give me full netherite and then jump scare me? I mean, I'll take the netherite, but don't do that again. I don't know what I was thinking. I've played too much FNAF to think that I wasn't going to get jump scared. And, okay, so there should be... Oh, yeah, mutant mobs right around the corner. Hey, what's up there, big guys? Okay, I think this is just the mutant zombie. Me and the mutant zombie go way back. This was actually one of the first Minecraft mods that I ever installed. And usually these guys are a lot more hostile, but it seems like Betty found a way to make them a lot more peaceful. We love that. Good job, Betty. Have a good day, guys. And last but not least, what? How did we get this? Okay, my cow, Bessie, definitely captured the wither storm because usually this thing eats my entire Minecraft world, but not this time. Oh, yeah, dude. What the flip? No, 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 no. I didn't mean to hit you. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, chill, 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 chill. Just chill for two seconds. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, it's eating me. I can't escape it. Oh, my goodness. What the heck is happening? Get, get off my booty. Oh, my gosh. No, no, no. It's exploding everything. Just chill. Chill for two seconds. Uh, nothing to see here. Let me just see here. It's fine. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here before I accidentally blow up the entire zoo. Every time I get near the blood golem, I just get this, like, creepy feeling. I don't know. Obviously, they have some really weird sound effects, but it's kind of more than that. Like, it feels like something is in the trees. I don't know. Like, what is that up there? Luckily, I have all of these ghosts around me, so I'm not that worried. And we now have over $20,000, so I could definitely afford to get a blood vessel exhibit. I didn't even know that was a thing. And we could also get... A a skibbity exhibit. Of course, we have to have skibbity in our zoo. And that means there's probably only one or two more exhibits left. Hello there, Mr. Clowns. Ooh, what's this one? Hello. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, yep. All right. Okay. Yep. These are the blood vessels. All right. Let's check them out. Hey there, little guys. Um, so you should not be possible. Blood vessels should be like inside of your body and stuff. <laughs> no, 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 no. Please get off me. Please. I don't want to ride on you. Please. Please. Oh God. This is so weird. I don't like it. It literally won't let me go. Oh god. Oh, I'm gonna pop a blood vessel. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, um, I killed it. I had to do what I had to do. Alright, just keep your weird blood vessel -y tentacles away from my body. Ah, uh, dudes, that creeped me out. I don't like that. I don't like blood. And if we come around the corner here, oh, this is definitely skibbity toilet. I know skibbities when I see them. Hey, skibbities. Okay, it seems like these are low-level skibbities, which is fine. G-Man isn't here or any of the higher-level guys. I'm gonna leave. And wow, these villagers have been Busy. Busy filling up my bank account. Let's go ahead and spend that on Scary Steve. How scary could Steve be? And wait, guys, the next exhibit I can get is Hero Bride himself. That's going to be my main attraction. First things first, let's go check out the brand new Scary Steve exhibit. Hey, what's up, Steve? Can I get inside? Is this broken? Okay, that's probably not up to code anymore. Let's go ahead and just patch that up. You guys saw nothing. Oh, oh, what the? Angry Steve said, I will help keep Hero Bride in line. Hop on my back. But what are you talking about? I don't even have here, O'Brien. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the? Whoa. Oh my. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I'm not, I'm not gonna look on your face. We'll get you a paper bag for that. Don't worry. What does he mean? He'll help me keep Herobrine in check. Giant Alex also said something weird about Herobrine, didn't she? Excuse me. Pardon me. Yes, I gotta get through. We have a Herobrine problem to deal with. Steve has definitely seen better days. I mean, I really hope Steve was lying about Herobrine, but let's go ahead and find out in three, two, one. Herobrine. Whoa. Uh, where did Giant Steve go? I, wait, why did it turn nighttime? Is this the Herobrine exhibit? Oh my god, dude, wait a second. It actually is Herobrine. Let's go. <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, what's up, Herobrine? I mean, he can't be worse than like the old man or Five Nights at Freddy's, right? He seems fine. What the? What was that? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, what the? Did he just summon in a phantom? Oh my god. Yo, I'm getting damaged. I'm not supposed to be able to get damaged in my own zoo. What the? I don't even have any weapons. I need to go get scary mutant Steve back. Even though I didn't really like looking at his face, I'm sure he could probably help. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is Herobrine doing out of its exhibit? Holy smokes, dudes. This isn't good. This isn't good. Betty, we got a code Herobrine. Call Bessie. I think Betty's possessed. Oh, sick, dude. Okay, when I'm riding on the back of Giant Steve, I should be able to shoot out explosive bats. I think it's working. Oh, I see Herobrine. Yes, dude, here we go. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Get down here, you ugly chunk. Okay, okay, all right. Herobrine is a lot more powerful than I thought he'd be. What was I thinking? Adding Herobrine to my zoo? Herobrine already scared away all of my customers. I'm not making any more money. This is terrible. Herobrine only has a little bit more health left. We're almost there. Eat my bats, Herobrine. Oh, come on. Yes, we can do this. We did it. And check it out. All of the customers are coming back. And it looks like we were able to contain Herobrine after all. Who's a good little guy?